Thank you so much for staying tuned to this channel. If you just joined us, this is Sunday's edition of This Morning on ITV. And it's all about the security situation in Edo states. We are taking a look at Vigilante and, of course, formation of other security outfits. You've heard uh, from members of our police anti courtism Yes, Vigilante Group, their general commander and, of course, a commandant also in the group. They've spoken at length on how far they've gone and what they've been doing to really make a dose state safe. With me here in the studio to throw more light on this, I have a political analyst. Yes, both of them are political analysts. Uh, join me to welcome Dr. Samson Isibo. Happy New Year. It's been a while. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Happy New Year to have you viewers. All right. So very close to him is uh, uh, a, a man of, you know, of, we talk about what and um, political, uh, a, a juggernaut, so to speak. <laughs> Jeremy, to welcome mm -hmm. Odige Wadea. Welcome to TMI, so this edition. Yeah, thank you, um, viewers. Thank you. All right, now here we are. We are faced with a situation. You, you heard the first set of analysts, what they've done so far, what they tend to do if they have enough backing and, of course, encouragement. Uh, from your own point of view, Dr. Samson Isibo, yes, PhD, please. Uh, do you think that with formation of all this vigilante group and regional uh, security outfit, do you think that a dose will be out of the wood soon? We'll talk about security challenges. Well, uh, happy new year, viewers. Mm. To what you said, I really commended uh, the efforts of the vigilante uh, groups and other security groups. But uh, their effort is not enough. Mm. We still need the real architecture of security from the state government per se. The present one we are having from the federal government, they have disappointed us. They have not been performing. So that is why we need the state government's uh, outfit, security mm. outfit, just like other states. All this one we are talking here, yes, uh, vigilante groups, uh, Wabazi Gardens, and that they are just, uh, uh, I can say, just a political structure. It doesn't work. You see, the the the, the insecurity is getting higher day by day in uh, those states. Now it's not a thing we so much uh, uh, admire. People are being uh, extorted through ransom paid. People are being killed anyhow. People of different caliber, those that are to boost our economy, those that are to move to higher level, they are being wasted by miscrants from other uh, planet, not even my, from a uh, state, from other uh, section of the country coming mm -hmm. here, dominating us, scaring us. It's very annoying. So. The, the present uh, uh, federal government uh, security architecture and I just say they have disappointed with the NDG. Mm -hmm. They have not been working. Oh, right. see? So that is why we, we need a brand new security network of the state government mm -hmm. to come in. Okay, I, I, I will come back to you shortly. Well, uh, Honorable Dikio, you heard him. He talked about not being satisfied with the security situation. Talked about the apparatus put in place by the state and federal government. According to his word, yeah. disappointed the aging. <coughs> For what he's suggesting, a brand new outfit. What do you think about that? Well, uh, thank you. I think this issue has uh, received a lot of uh, discussion mm. locally and nationally. Um, what will have the federal colleagues? It will not work in a country like Nigeria. We have a federal system, but the police or the the police system is a unitary system where everything comes from the federal. And the problem with us is this: we know what the problem is. We do not find a lasting solution to our problem. The idea of forming vigilante or regional security outfit, it will not work. What we need 
is state police and local government police. For us to effectively arrest the nefarious activities of this uh, I mean, hoodlums, mm -hmm. the state must have its own police. <clears throat> Let me learn. In those days, in the 50s and 60s, we used to have, uh, you know, the custody books. And the, the breakings that we have well, mm. coming, they still go or still a uh, uh, bicycle. But now they are becoming more sophisticated. Mm. Then instead of ox to also grow and equip what we have and establish what we match what you know, you know, I mean, their own capacity, we are saying, let us form a vigilante group. Vigilante of what? Mm -hmm. Have farmers, you know, carpenters, unemployed people, ask, you know, vigilante, no. What you really need, just like you have in other professions, security, business, or management is as difficult as every other profession. Mm -hmm. We need competent hands. We need experts. We need people to go for in training services mm. so that we can address this issue once and for all. What we really need to do, what I was thinking that the, the, the state ought to have done, it's as simple as what the, this man did in the Zamfara. Mm. For one reason or the other, uh, Ahmed, uh, is it Sani Ahmed, mm -hmm. who was the governor of Zamfara, came on board. Within the first 100 days, he established Sharia state in Zamfara. Another state followed. I know the reaction of the federal government by then, Olusha Obasanjo, he said, it will soon fizzle out. See, what they did, they took action and we reacted. So what we also need to do, or what we have been doing, we have been reacting to their action for the first time. Let us take action and let the federal government react. Mm -hmm. We have a state. They should domesticate the establishment of state police and local government police and let the federal government take us to court. Okay. By so doing, they will now go and try the constitution. The constitution will be on trial. The, the federal government constitution will be on trial and people will trail the constitution to basics. So, waiting for the, the federal government to come and establish or allow us to establish a state police or a local government police, it will not work. So, the idea of meandering around the formation of state and local government police uh, through the formation of regional. Uh, outfit, uh, the vigilante arrow, we are just wasting our time. The time has come. Mm. The state, various things, try and establish, nothing will happen. What they need to do is form a state police and let the federal government take us to court. All right, so you're saying that it's like, you know, the forceful approach, that is what you're really taking a look at right now. Okay, I, I will come back to you. That's the best alternative. I, I will come back to you on that because I believe that for it to form a state police, the federal government must be in the know. He talked about state policing. It's been on for quite a while. If you go to the page of the newspaper, bringing it down to Edo State, uh, where uh, people are like saying that Edo State right now is... Uh, I want to put it now, the speed of insecurity is frightening, yes, right? And various groups have been formed. You heard one group before you said, came in, they talk about their exploit and all of that. But like saying that, that was how Amoteko was brought into the scene. And right now, they are doing wonders in the southwestern region of Nigeria. Do you think that that should be what a dose stage we're calling for, even right now? Thank you, my brother. That is what I was about to say. Mm. That uh, we are in, in need of this Amotekun thing. Mm. It's overdue. Long overdue. See, you have said it all. See the wonder they are performing in the Western uh, sector. See, as at yesterday, in fact, 
the fear of Amotekun is the beginning of reason for this uh, mm -hmm. others. This fool yes me. See what they did two days ago. Mm -hmm. They, you see, their structure is well designed that they are not up in to, 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 to have their seat in the in the in the, in the urban area. Mm -hmm. They move to the rural areas. They, they, they have their structure with the local people. The, in the, at the local government level, you see them at their uh, uh, local government headquarters. Mm -hmm. Day before yesterday, for instance, uh, one of the others kidnapped a citizen of uh, Oyo, Oyo State, Pasi, mm -hmm. one place they call Shaki, and they collected five million naira ransom. And when they informed these uh, Amotekun people, they swam into action. They went after these people. Immediately, those people saw the Amotekun, they picked race with their car, with everything. They, 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 they disappeared. And those people pursued them. They exchanged gunfire. Many of the so called uh, kidnappers were gone down. And they ran away from uh, this, uh, your state. I think that is what's supposed to have been happening in uh, in uh, in uh, those states uh, where we've been seeing them at a uh, hotel, uh, mm -hmm. uh, They have domin uh, dominated the place. They have dr driven away the inhabitants. They have their headquarters there. They move out, move in any time. You see, this the gory states we've been hearing from that that uh, place is 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 terrible. We need with our this uh, local pol police or vigilante, they can't go inside. It's just not by mouth. No, but one said if, if, if they're given adequate support, they can go into this bush, into this forest. Let us we call go. the with mm. what? With ordinary arm of, or with their gun? Of course, they'll be armed. Uh, who is going to give them the arm? Mm. Who is going to guarantee them? We have to be careful in rushing people, say vigilante, go inside. After, the, after that, what next? Where is our gun? Where is our ammunition? So we have to be very careful. Let there be fundamental security. As my brother has rightly said, state police or this Amotekun thing. You know, there were so many uh, resistance to Amotekun by the powers that be and the other section of the country. But they insisted. They put it through their the, uh, state uh, 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 house of assembly. They mm -hmm. passed it into law. And they went in. And they are performing wonders from Mundo say to your to go show everywhere. It just there is peace there. Mm. But here now we are just like a uh, foul to them. They pick us like uh, no, uh, no, 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 no. I wouldn't really, really subscribe to that foul uh, okay, uh, example, please. Okay, they, they yeah. pick us yeah. like uh, yeah. slave yeah. people. Yeah. Not even slave. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. okay. They okay. pick us okay. like an uh, ordinary yeah. person. Yeah. 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 So <laughs> what we are saying in essence is that yeah. we, we need this type of uh, mm. amotekun mm. Uh, mm. Uh, uh, thing in our state here. Yeah. Yeah. That will be they will be well trained, orientated, mm. and not just ordinary. Okay, I'm a vigilante. I'm a security alert. No, it has to be well structured, well uh, 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 grounded. Uh, they will, uh, their, 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 their duty is not going to be inside the town. Go inside, follow them to their jugular, mm. to inside the forest. It's our forest, our father's land. Foreigners cannot know it more than us. But in this state now, they know the forest more than us. Go to my wife's uh, 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 village uh, around the Rokosa in the Bodie. You should go there, you'll be surprised. You see the, 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 the number of uh, full and uh, outside people, they are not by the citizens in that village. Oh, huh? mm -hmm. I wonder, in fact, for me to go there now, I'm afraid. My Lord died now to go there for a bit, I can't go. And the fear of uh, those people is the beginning of wisdom. So what it's I'm not saying, all of them that are bad for crying out loud. What work are they doing? Because yeah. it's like painting everybody bad. That uh, is not what we are here to do. Yeah, you cannot okay. get yes. everybody cannot be bad. Mm. Uh, in the situation where majority of them are into nefarious activities, activities. Mm. then the tendency for you to group, group, group them. everybody mm. together. So they are notoriously known for that mm. so uh, you see i'm still of the opinion and uh, new nigeria initiative mm. uh, speaking the minds of the group is that seeking the approval from the federal government will take a herculean task you know how they try to frustrate the creation of a mm. but when they found his bar mm. mm. Did they consult the federal government? The answer is no. You understand? They know how to take action. 
as, as, as long as force will change the profit of the law in their own domain, then to uh, the federal government can take them to court if they want to. Must we or why should we go to the federal government and appeal for approval? You have his bar in uh, Kanu or Kaduna mm -hmm. everywhere. So we also can do the same without a recourse to the federal government. But his bar is not called the state police. Or oh, well, whatever, whatever you want to call it. It is and because, state police. Because, because, because whatever you want to call According to them, his bar is like a vigilante group. No, also. So and we have vigilante us, group brother, saying that those states. The word, using the word police, mm. it is not the exclusive right of the federal government. It's just mm. a word. Do they have a patent uh, right to that word? No. So we can form our own state police. And let them it is a constitutional issue. Mm. You can initiate and let them go to court. The court will decide. Mm. What about the JTF? Yeah. So these are, the are the things we can do. We know all this is. So sending, sending uh, the vigilante with their gong to go and meet uh, the hexman with AK-47. AK-48, AK-48. AK-48, AK-49, AK-90. All these things are available to them. Mm. We have security votes. If money can be, uh, I mean, directed, forget about the, uh, I mean, the state police. We don't have state police in Edo State right now. You understand? And this is the reason. They say necessity is the uh, of invasion. Uh, of invasion. Mm. Since the police have refused to perform their civil responsibilities. You can't say they refuse to no, perform. No, 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 no. You can't say they refuse Since to perform. After the, the NSAS movement, mm. they have refused. But I've seen some policemen out there on the no, road doing no, their job. They are not doing their job, my I've brother. seen them. There was an mm. incident that happened. Yes. I called the police. The, 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 the armed robbers were in, uh, uh, in my stepmother's house. Mm. I called, uh, I mean, their control room at about uh, 11 o'clock in the night mm. that armed robbers are there. In the control room, I said, okay, we'll be there. Two hours later, I called. They were nowhere to be found. The next day, I went there and I asked the police, they said no. I called the control room again. The gentleman that picked up the phone told me, oh, we came, we were patrolling the area. I said, you must be out of your mind. I called you, were you not supposed to have called me upon your arrival? And I said there was an activity going on inside the house. You were patrolling outside. That means you did not go. So as far as I'm concerned, there is no police activity in Edo. And this is the more reason for Edo State, based on that singular reason, Edo State will establish that state police and let us go to court. Hmm. Establishing that state police and waiting for a court injunction, but the exclusive right of formation of anything police is in the hands of, of the federal government according to the constitution. That would be a violation of oh. the constitution. So when they declare the state of I'll, Saria, I will come back I, to you. I mean, what happened? Of course, the military went in there. They Shall went they in there. No. They went in there. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on. No. I will come back to you. I will come back to you. Now, he talked about a state forming their own secure, uh, the state police. He talked about also uh, so many other factors. And local that government police. And local government police. Yeah. Okay, fine. Now, if you take a look at the situation, there are groups already on the ground. Uh, some few weeks ago, uh, the governor initiated, you know, the local government, you know, or, or police branch, so to speak, community policing to go to the local government to start doing their job of inter-gathering in a way to fight against criminal elements. Do you think that is also a plus in the side of the government in the fight against insecurity? I don't think so. Yes. Why do you think so? They are just trying to circumvent the, the existing uh, state, uh, I mean, federal police. Is they are saying the same thing. What we are saying, they are saying is that let this, it, who, who pays the paper, they take the tune. If by the, what do you call it, the one you, are, you just mentioned, is still under federal, isn't mm. it? Mm. And uh, if there are some, you know who is controlling federal. You know where the tribe comes from. Yeah. And the same particular tribe that are disturbing us, killing yeah. us, mm -hmm. collecting mm -hmm. ransom mm -hmm. from us. If the if they intend to go to to meet uh, those uh, miscreants, uh, uh, full and near me, 
Uh, the man at the top is a full animal. He will, trust he will just order that if you try it, he will remove your. your you are not your, there your, to know if it's going to trust it. Yeah, you are now using common sense. You are now using common sense. Which kind of problem? I haven't proven yet. Even if it's your own opinion, yes. Even if it's your own opinion, it's just that simple opinion. I know, but I know. The man at the top. Is a full animal, yes. and those people disturbing us, killing us, they ah, are full animals. Men, no, no, it, oh, oh, hold on, hold on. Oh, this is no. where I put my foot down. Yeah. Now, the choreo, mm. please, gentlemen. Mm. The choreo is not right for you to color or for you to allege that all of them, because you are generalizing. We do not generalize, okay? okay let me okay. come down. A majority. Because those people that you know through experience, those people that take uh, you who are lucky to, to to come out from the the, 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 the bush where they were tied down. They they, they mentioned full and yes, men, they did not mention a, a, a dumb man or a data man or an evil man. Ah oh, more than ninety nine percent of them are full and yes, men. And they stayed inside that uh, thick bush. What do we say? We like because uh, we are afraid now, mm -hmm. so that um, what is it? Who will die? They've been killing us, killing our our, our, our relatives, collecting ransom, heavy ransoms. Mm -hmm. you, right. know, you know, you know, the only uh, this uh, Chris, uh, uh, Christmas special. I can't travel because I I fear that if I'm picked up like uh, this foul now, where will I see money to pay for ransom? Okay. I can't get a one million, not talk of five million, ten million they are collecting. Okay. So it's not to die. All right. So let me land now. Okay. So that is where this state police or Amote Kuntin is very, very germane, very necessary. Okay. And the, the, the state governor should take it up. After all, he's, he is collecting more than 100 million uh, state uh, security votes. What is he here doing we it for? go again, generalizing. Uh, uh, he's not generalizing yeah, now. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm a politician. Dr. And Sam I know Sam where the money is. I know how much they are collecting. Dr. Sam Dr. Sam are collecting. Uh, Why are we Sam hiding things? Dr. Okay, Sam he's Sam collecting Sam security votes. Is it a lie? Okay, Dr. Sam 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 we do not generalize. Yeah. Mm. You, you can say, according to the report, this is yeah. what they say. Don't say okay. they are the one yeah. telling us. Okay. No, that is totally okay. out it's all right. of okay. it. So yeah. please be guarded. Yeah. Please be guarded. I understand. Yeah. All right, so I understand. Mm. That was why I said, whatever I say here mm. is the opinion of New Nigeria Initiative. Even if it's your opinion, uh, yeah, I'm mm. even, if it's, ITV, even if it's your opinion, ITV but please, opinion. your opinion must be guarded. Okay, good. All right. What I'm trying to say is that why mm. we not agree with the approach now mm. is that whoever is in charge of that security outfit, mm. just like you rightly said, probably somebody from, you know, Maduguri. Mm. Then uh, the, uh, I mean, the commander of ground is from Benin. Then you ask him to go to Orion mm. to go and arrest somebody in Orion. He doesn't, the man from Maduguru cannot even um, pronounce Oriyama. Mm -hmm. So if you call him on the phone, say somebody is, uh, there's an activity uh, along a Rusek Benadouwa street. Mm -hmm. He might give a wrong information instead of saying a Rusek, I say a Ruga, mm -hmm. a Goga. So they will now go to a different, so that is why it is always better. You use a local person. Somebody from Benin cannot become a security a, a guard in Oriomo. It has to be people from Oriomo, from that locality. Mm. You understand? So the, 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 the admonition, the approach is wrong. If you are in Benin, yes, you can man Benin City. If you are from Ego, you man Ego. Don't take somebody from Benin City I mean to go and man Ego. It's not done. Mm. This is where we have problem. You bring a commissioner from uh, you know, you know, I mean, from Lagos, I mean, to Benin. You bring AIG, I mean, from Sokoto to Benin. Then all the the commander, the DPO, I mean, majority of them are from the north. They don't know anywhere in Benin. So where are the Edo people? Are they not qualified? So you see that the approach is wrong and it will not work. We should not deceive ourselves. Um, I heard where the the, the former discoverer that the the IG. As they that they should match 
gun, uh, I mean, you know, I'm a fire with fire. That if they see there, they should kill them. He didn't use the word, can you just say break down? Uh, uh, break, so break, please, say, let's not pick okay, the word. You just say break, break down. Uh, yeah. break down. Mm. I think what, I'm, uh, what I understand by mm. break down is, now, assuming I have a gun mm. and I'm not uh, a kidnapper, it is for my uh, protection, uh, yeah, uh, protection mm. and he sees the gun, he breaks me down. Is that right? To even tell you for the IG to have given such a directive, that is a pointer or a pretense that the man is not even competent as a security officer of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. The man is not even competent. So you, this is you why cannot you need say, it's like it's you like, cannot say that the IG is not competent. There is a reason for that. The mention the IG said order from above. Order from the IG. Above, okay. order, so please, he, 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 he never said the IG. Uh, uh, he so never what, said the IG. No, please let the guard. Okay, okay. Let the guard. Okay, yeah. whoever the person at that apex mm. is not competent. I mean, you don't give such directive. All right. Uh, well, this is quite an emotional topic, and emotions are like very, very hard. We're talking about all of this. We'll continue in this discussion after this break. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Security situation in Edo State, Vinilante slash regional security outfits is what we are taking a look at today's installment of this morning on ITV. Do stay tuned. The number of street kids is growing by the day. Many are exposed to the vagaries of life, including death. You can do something to rescue these innocent souls roaming our streets. Be the change today. Support an orphanage. This message is brought to you courtesy independent television. We're now at the concluding end, uh, or let's say the end part of uh, the discussion segment of this morning on ITV. We're taking a look at uh, the security situation in Edo State, New Vigilante slash regional uh, security outfits, how they are going to help curb the menace of insecurity in Edo State. And of course, I have Honorable. Uh, Odige Wadiai and uh, Dr. Samson is Sibon. I'm speaking at length on this particular issue. Now, let me come to you, Dr. Samson is Sibon. Uh, the first set of guests that came out, they said they can go to that bush. You know, that bush at Ekboma. You know, uh, uh, the, the message went viral on the social media about a man that paid ransom though he was released. He talked about the forest in Ekboma. So, I'm saying that uh, we have some also along uh, uh, Benin Ondo Road. Yeah, there's a forest there also. Don't you think that if this vigilante group, if they're empowered, if they're encouraged, if they're well equipped, like what the commander of all the commander talked about, they can go into those bushes and fish out these kidnappers. Well, I commended their effort, their enthusiasm, that uh, it is easier said than done. Mm -hmm. And I will not let them to go and commit suicide there. Before you can go to confront those people with a sophisticated weapons, the 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 art, uh, outfit we are talking about they will be well trained mm. they, will, will, they will be given orientation not that they uh, take a gun go inside but go and uh, commit suicide <laughs> go commit suicide I, how uh, you know the, you, the, you mentioned the guy that came out from the from the bush mm. uh, that uh, they sent him to the commissioner for that you go and tell the commissioner for that they are ready they have taken over the bush they are mm. waiting for them Mm. Is it that this, this type of people you just go and confront with just ordinary, maybe uh, a gone or, or what, what type of a thing gone? So they need a real well equipped, well trained manpower mm. who knows the will with that. I'm not a security expert, mm. but they, they, they are, they are I, don't, I don't advise government to just empower them with money. Yeah, go. 
No, they say they don't need money. Just give them what they need to work with equipment. With yeah, what, after all, most of them, uh, according to their own statistics, they have hunters in the group. They have OPC, Where? and of course, they have repentance coaches. They are all ready. And uh, the commander of our commander is a hunter, so he knows this bush. He knows the forest. Don't so you think that is the right way to go about no, this? No, no, no. The anonymity of that uh, security, uh, insecurity in that place, requires mm. retrained, well sophisticated. Uh, manpower like a Montecum. A Montecum, they don't, they, they don't fight the, with the, the battle by themselves. They still use the hunters, the vigilantes. They and they have these two in the group. You see? They have what? They have hunters two in the group. They have vigilantes. Yeah. a combination of everyone they, they coming they together. The, 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 the way with that, they don't have the, the, the training of combating uh, crime. What we are saying are not just shabbily treated people who are going inside. They should be well uh, structured. They should have commander. They should have uh, every aspect of uh, uh, administration. Okay. That, uh, and they, right. should, they should be that should be a head that should be responsible. Like that of uh, Amotekun when they went for a, 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 uh, an arrest day before inside. Their commander general, a, a retired colonel. colonel was was one that uh, was uh, uh, responsible for what is happening there. He said he's going to give them feedback to them, like that, like that sort mm -hmm. of thing. That is what we need in Edo State. Let there be a structure of a security that will be well funded, well trained to face the something. But not just okay. I'm a vigilante. I'm on no PC. Mm -hmm. Let me go inside which and confront uh, those people. Whom are we going to hold responsible for any any mm -hmm. mis misadventure over there? So me don't have faith in this. It I is. Well, uh, uh, that okay. is on, uh, your young yeah, opinion. Yeah, yeah. Your young opinion. Yeah, 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 but, 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 still, but but still, yeah. you heard uh, the young man. He said yeah. they are ready because they have almost everyone yeah. in the group giving so much assurance because if, it's, if, if you feel the pulse right now and do say it's like they're almost even a sigh of relief because it's a reduction right now in the killing and of course that they have uh, they had a great part to play yes but do you think if they can go to Ubogui the forest then yeah. Ubogui the forest there Nekboma they yeah. can easily flush Odigi out and, that, Odigi yes. and the rest yeah, of them there's a possibility that yes they can mm. do do that mm. and uh, just like uh, they said uh, we don't really under, know what structure the government has on ground. Mm -hmm. With what you've just said now, maybe in the Aches board uh, room, they have all these retired, you know, I mean, military officers from Edo uh, South to Edo uh, North. So they are part of, they could be part of the board of directors that are really do all the strategy. Then at the end of the day, yes. Their presence has been fed, you know, positively. Mm -hmm. And should they go to any area and they make use of the indigenous of that locality, mm -hmm. yeah, definitely they understand the terrain and they'll be able to uh, uh, effectively police that area. Mm -hmm. we, you know, we need to flush them out by mm -hmm. any means necessary. And that is what the vigilante is all about. Mm. So they understand the terrain. And whoever, I mean, when they are going on a mission, definitely the so called uh, 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 trade, I mean, military officers mm. will be there with them. Retired police officers, they'll be there with them. And they'll be able to tell them what to do. So those, the guy that you just saw, are the field zodiacs not the strategics. Mm -hmm. So let them let us give them the benefit of doubt that they will do XYZ for the benefit of the Edo people. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Before well, the, well, the well, establishment of uh, that, uh, for instance, state police. To go for this type of uh, outfit, mm -hmm. you have insurance, insurance cover. But well, we don't know. Go, go, mm -hmm. Government should provide all those things. That's part of the the administrative structure I'm talking about, mm -hmm. apart from the logistics, the, the providing vehicles this and that, what about insurance? Should anything be followed upon them? What is mm -hmm. going to bear the, 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 the cost or the consequences? Mm -hmm. What is going to be for? So there are a lot of things, not just yeah. go to inside. Yeah. Well, we can't cover all those ones the here. Even mm -hmm. the police, do they have life insurance? 
the federal, I mean, so-called, you know, you know, I'm a federal police, mm. or the, you know, the federal military. Did they have insurance? No. So why would you think uh, I'm a the vigilante? Probably the state have made provisions for all these things we don't know. All right. Well, uh, to call it a wrap on this show, let's take a look at what the presidency talked about, saying that before this year runs out, we will to crush insurgency. That insurgency, banditry, kidnapping will come to an end. Yes, yes, insurgency. And moreover, uh, moreover also, Wally Shoyeko talked about we going after soldiers of fortunes, talking about mercenaries to come help us to fight insurgency. That is going to be uh, the, the, the last line on this discussion. What do you feel about that? Well, whatever the mm. president said, it's not something we should take it seriously. He has been making so many promises. He is, Mr. President. Yes, yes, yes. yes. We know. It's so we should take it seriously. He has religion his uh, promises. That's why we voted for him that he's going to crush these people within the next six months. He, 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 now giving us another information that uh, within the, before 2023 20, or so, that uh, the uh, Boko Haram will be no more. He, that is not what we want action. Action. Not that uh, you should go and start uh, 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 mm -hmm. negotiating with the bandits, Boko Haram, giving them our uh, uh, hard hand money. Anyhow, mm -hmm. that is not what we want. We want crushing defeat. And this thing, if, if they are serious, within the next two, three months, they should be able to overrun the uh, Sambisa. The, 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 the whole uh, uh, length of that Sambisa is not more than 30 uh, kilometers, as they said. Why can't they overrun? Why are they parabolating around one particular area? They can't push forward, they can't push backward. They are just on one, on one, on one, on one state. So, the, 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 I'm sorry to say, the president is just deceiving the, the uh, No, 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 you just, just can't say that. You just can't say that. To me, deceiving me. Yeah, okay, uh -huh. he's deceiving you, but, yes. but that's your, even yes. if it's your own statement, he's not deceiving anybody. He's, he's, he's giving he's, you a projection see, of what they're really working on. The more on. he says something, the more he will <laughs> need on it. We can't move forward. And Anyway, for now, let's take his vote to the bank. Okay, now what do they say about this? So stop saying he's deceiving anybody. It's not deceiving. <laughs> well, yeah. Uh, my opinion is not far from uh, the opinion of Dr. Isibo. Mm. Uh, before Buhari came on board, when uh, Jonathan was uh, still the president, uh, Jonathan made effort to attack Boko Haram. The statement that uh, Buhari made was that an attack on Boko Haram is an attack on the Northern Axe. I quote, attack on the Buhara is an attack mm. on the Northern Axe. But when he came in, he said I'm he never said that. That's what he would. But he, he said he never said that. He, he, because he all, because, because, because all the things you're saying, he refuted Please. it. Okay, good. He said he didn't say it. Okay. So let's and, take it like that. Yeah. So, yes. are we not? Uh, then, if he said that, though he reneged that, he did not say that. Mm. He's going to find it difficult mm -hmm. to attack his brothers. And two, the people that are more involved in this, you know, kidnapping, banditry, they are the Fulani hex men. And they are members of Miyati Allah. No, now you're and generalizing. No, no. They are uh, members of the Miyati uh, 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 Allah. Now, now, this is where I put my foot on the ground. You okay. are generalizing, and we don't allow that on air because you can't prove okay. it. Okay. You are saying Miyati all of them. Where's, okay. You some are generalizing. Okay. Some if you say some, okay, okay, fine. Some, some better, them but not all of them. Because some good ones. Some of them are members. Okay. Some of them are members of Miyati Allah. And the president of Nigeria is the last patron of the same Meati Allah. Just like a, a, a Dr. Sibo Averani question. Do you now expect a, a patron knowing fully well that some of his members are the one creating uh, the you know atrocities? He will now send his soldiers to go and kill them. It's not possible. Don't forget about the successful air raids of the Nigerian 
efforts. Don't forget oh, also successful. about the accomplishment of some military personnel sent up north in Brownu to extinguish, to neutralize insurgents, Boko Haram to be precise. Don't forget about also some of the targets taken out in the Zambeza forest. These are Those exploit. are political statements. No, uh, no, 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 no. I, I am trying to put the pressure right, right now. These are exploits oh, by this administration. Uh, All right. Uh, now people. So please. Just say something so, yeah. Yeah. No, 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 no. no. I mean, According to you, so it's is not for the shooting because right now they are marching forward. Let's leave it oh, at that. Thank, you, thank, you. thank you, gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so, so, so much. Say, well, okay. you've heard them. Whatever you heard them say is their opinion. Even at that, they have to be guided. What follows our regulations governing the airwaves? Gentlemen, I appreciate you, both of you, for sharing your thoughts and, of course, your opinions about all this. Security is a collective responsibility. All right? If yeah. you do your part, I do my part. You see something, you see say it. something, and, of course, you do something, it does still be safer for all of us to live in. Bye for now.